Hi, in IC technology, dry oxidation using dry oxygen as compared to wet oxidation using steam or water wafer produce which have the maximum impact factor that is quality growth in growth rate what are the things and process which is having the fastest one which is having the least and which is having the quality these kind of things we have to analyze here whenever we have the two components two big things like dry oxidation wet oxidation we should understand we should study the dry oxidation completely in separate way and wet oxidation in the separate way and combining those two into a single term will give us the which is up and after the answer here so first we are going for dry oxidation dry oxidation is working with pure oxygen and this oxygen means it's a like it's not in a liquid form it's a in a vapor not a vapor form it's a gas form it be injected through through the any kind of mean not any kind of medium it's a direct injection so and next point is it acts it's in 1200 degree celsius that is in to we have to do dry oxidation in yes to a semiconductor means we have to the environment of the growth in the environment of the manufacturing that uh, that is oxidation process occurred in the lab should be in 1200 degree celsius that is the acceptable growth rate of that and in the dry oxidation have better quality and dry oxidation has thin highly controlled uh, gate oxide so uh, the dry oxidation having the minimum that is thin value of gate oxide and we go for the dry wet oxidation wet oxidation used not used water water vapor and it's used under the condition of the temperature condition of 900 degree 2000 degree celsius and which is progenic oxidation and hydrogen oxygen ratio will be 2 is to 1 which this wet oxidation is a rapid process and it which gives the thick filled oxides so comparing these two values we will have the which is we can say that which is best one we have the pure one better quality and this is have used by water wafer and which is have rapid process so according to when we are comparing dry oxidation to wet oxidation means we sh we can say that better quality and pure oxygenation like so on we should not end this uh, analysis for this question by studying the dry oxidation and wet oxidation itself we should go for what are the things existing in the real life in real life they are looking for atomic layer decomposition deposition that is applying chemical chemical surgeon sort uh, give chemical surgeons to a layer to form a oxidation layer by interacting and having the com inter inter interaction of the atoms to that so in the atomic layer deposition will be more perfected one in the future thank you your comments are welcome